In this tutorial, we are going to see how to connect the fiber optics cable in the network in Cisco Packet Tracer. So for that, we will establish the connection between the router and the PC. So we will take the router as PT router and place it over here and we will take one PC and place it over here. Double click on the PC, you will find out this panel. Inside that, you have to first look at the physical turn off this PC then this port is for the fast Ethernet port and remove this then insert FGE port for the fiber optics cable here in the modules you can see FGE port here and insert over here and turn it on similarly you have to do this process in the router the initial ports which look like FGE but it is not FGE, it is FFE, so you can remove it also. For that, you have to turn your router off. So, remove that ports, then insert FGE port over there, then close it. Then, in the connection, you will find out the fiber wire, then you can connect to port number 4, fiber optic, that is gigabit. Ethernet port number 4 and here in the PC gigabit Ethernet port number 0 then this connection is established but it is not physic it is physical connection so double click on the PC then in config you will find out in the interface gigabit Ethernet 0 and make sure it is on similarly in the router in config okay router must be power on so turn on this router okay it is still booting so please wait until it is finished so in config it is now booted in interface you will find out the gigabit ethernet core which we had connected the fiber wire then make sure it is on so now that arrow will become green so that the physical connection is established here successfully. So now it's time for the logical connection. For the logical connection you have to assign the IP address to each and every device in the network. So assign one IP address to the router also to the PC. First I will assign it to the PC as static IP address that is 192.168.1.2 and it will automatically generate subnet mask and in similar way you have to give the IP address to the Ethernet gigabit Ethernet port 4 as 192.168.1.1 and it will generate subnet mask and so here our logical connection is also established successfully so here click on this arrow for checking the status and keep one packet over here that is source that is sender and this is destination that is receiver so our packet is successfully sent and the question is that what we will do if you want the fiber optic cable in the switch so select one switch you will select the switch as PT switch keep it over here then double click on it this initial port as it is it is not FGE it is FFE so you can remove it there is the panel here you can remove this port so for that you have to turn it off remove it and then insert FGE ports over here and in the similar way you can also use fiber optic in switch also.